Welcome to this video. In this video, I want to talk about how you can display an SAP FI document or an SAP document in general with an SAP ERP and SAP S4 HANA. And I think the most important topic you should know first is where are the data saved? So in which kind of SAP table? And to show you this right now, we open up the data browser. So the transaction code SE16N, uh, you know, you can also open up the data browser with the transaction code SE16 or with the transaction code SE16H. I prefer the SE16N and here you can enter the table containing information about posted SAP documents, the BKPF. Um, and within here, the accounting document header information are being saved and there you have a lot of components. If you would like to analyze this table further, just open up the ABAP dictionary SE11 or double click within the forward navigation, then you can analyze it further on. And here right now, I would just like to and these elect everything and just like to show the company code, document number, the fiscal year and the T code. So the transaction code, because there are a lot of transactions where you can post documents. So for example, the FB60 and once you execute this, then those documents are being shown. And then if we going back, then there's also, for example, the Miro and we execute it once again. So there those documents are being shown or if you like to for example just uh, leave it uh, blank and execute it once again then for example those information are being shown posted or created within a vl02n transaction code i have limited it up to 500 entries um yeah that's i think crystal clear and if you for example would like to display one specific SAP FI document. Then you have to open up the transaction FB03 within a command field. Then within here, you type in your document number, the company code and the fiscal year. And then it's important that you hit the enter key. You could also click on the document list button to make further selections based on uh, documents. And then you will also find your needed document I'm sure, but within here, I would just like to uh, hit the enter key and then your SAP FI document will be shown with all the items. If you double click on one item, then you will see uh, the detailed information about this. Within this icon, you can display the document header to see those information. And with additional data, you can also see um, additional data. Uh, if you are within here, then you can display the next item within this button. You can also go to this button. If you would like to go back to the overview, just click on the back button and then you are here once again. Um, you can also switch uh, between the uh, ledger view if you click on this and of course you have also the generic object list so the services for object to have more functions available. Yeah, but basically that's the transaction to display SAP FI documents. And I would also like to show you the FBL1N transaction code because within here you can display vendor line items. So um, you can uh, you have to enter your company code. You can leave the selection criteria for the vendor account empty. But if you want like to display all the line items for one specific vendor, then within in here you can type it in and there you can make some further selections if you want to so based on yeah on the on the status on some specific types but if you execute this then within here all the documents will be displayed displayed um don't worry this is a demo system so there are a lot of items overdue um but within here you see them and with double click uh, within the forward navigation you will jump into this document and can enter analyze it further on. Then there is one additional transaction code, the FBL3N, and compared to the FBL1N, this is a transaction to display the general ledger account line items. Um, here, once again, you have to enter your company code and you can enter um, one or multiple GL accounts. And then, um, once again, you can 
limit uh, the selection um, further uh, when you enter more selection criteria. But once you execute this, then you will see all those documents listed within here. All the documents are or have been already posted. Once again, with double click, you can jump into the document and analyze it further on. Within SAP Fiori, you are also able to display SAP FI documents. There are some SAP Fiori apps to, for example, display the document flow, but unfortunately, there is currently no specific app to display the FB03. So therefore, you can open up the SAP Fiori web GUI and within the command field there, you can type in the FB03, hit the enter key, and then you are within here. Here you can type in your document number, the company code and your fiscal year, hit the enter key, and then you are here as well. If you would like to create an own app for the FB03, and there I will link a video where I described how you can make this. And if you have any questions left, put them in the comment sections. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel to never miss great upcoming videos and to support my work. Thank you so much and see you in the next video.